Tampa is shining big time in the spotlight all week long, culminating in a Super Bowl 55 victory and a first for a team hosted ever in their home stadium. And Tampa Mayor Jane Castor getting used to these celebrations, really, because we've had several now. Eric Waxler caught up with her just a short time ago. Take a listen to this. Well, with the celebration still going on behind us, Mayor Jane Castor joins us. How do you put into words what just happened here tonight? I don't know if you can put it into words. This is just so exhilarating. It's exactly what our community needed. And I can't thank the Bucks enough, the Glazier family, and the NFL for making this happen. What an incredible game this was. We all thought it was going to be close, and it ended up being a blowout. So thank you, Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Tell us about your game day experience. Uh, it was definitely bizarre walking in and seeing all the cutouts and, and not as many fans, but uh, there was a lot of emotion in there. Yes, I kind of felt bad for Kansas City when the uh, announcer said, you know, do we have any Kansas City fans? And then he asked if there were any Buccaneer fans and the place exploded. So it really was wonderful. I think that uh, the Glazier family did a really good job of of giving that sensation of the, the uh, stadium being full with the cutouts. So it was, it was just a great game all the way around. And I couldn't be happier for our community. Lightning, Rays, now the Buccaneers. What does this do for the profile of Tampa, a city that is is on, you know, growing a, a, as we speak? Right. Uh, Tampa Bay is on fire right now. And this is just really another diamond in that crown to be able to, to say we have won all of these sporting events. And then tonight with the, the uh, uh, Super Bowl being the most watched sporting event in the world, the entire world's eyes were on Tampa Bay and all that is great about it. And then that performance by our Buccaneers, can't beat it. What's your message to the fans who are gonna be happy, are gonna to wanna to celebrate tonight and in the days to come? Well, I tell them celebrate like we always do. We embrace our teams, we celebrate, but we do it in a safe manner. If you can't distance separate, wear a mask, and just celebrate safely. We don't want anybody to get hurt. So have fun. Go Bucks. Can we expect a similar uh, celebration on the river uh, like we saw for the Lightning, yes, maybe? We definitely will have a safe <laughs> celebration. You can't not celebrate this. Oh, my gosh. It's unbelievable. And we'll be able to put a, a Vince Lombardi trophy next, next to a Stanley Cup. That's right. I know. That's why I told everybody we got to make a bigger trophy case now. Good problem to have. Exactly. Thank Bye. you, Mayor. Casey,